Hello, I'm Jerry Rigged, and this is the Duskers Daily Challenge for February 14th, 2019. Happy Valentine's Day. Looking at yesterday's leaderboard, a total of 15 players with Mustika taking a top score of 975, thanks to a good timing with one piece of scrap, basically. And not going to hold that against her. Marvin, myself, and Decavoid scored a 955. LB in 933, he also got that extra scrap, but had a little bit of a problem with a sentry, I believe. ITJ scored an 875, Dano an 830, Tonfun 750, Humaniatic a 575, and John a 540, with uh, 6 in the top 10, yeah, pretty, pretty normal there, just one less than usual, really. Today, I'm hoping we have stealth, I don't think that we've had that much stealth lately, so, nope, sensor again have had a lot of sensor lately. We do have very low drone health overall. One decent drone health with Tim. And unknown infestations on a military B. Now the good news is we'll probably have a defense. Bad news is whole integrity poor is a very bad sign. Let's see what we've got, see what we can do. There's a busted terminal right there, so that's not helpful. And all of the doors are already closed. Alright, I hear Swarm in R6. I'm thinking this is going to be a very time-sensitive thing. There could be slime in that room for all I know. Yeah, that's good enough. I guess. Yeah, not as much as I'd like, but... Well, this is very bad. I might lose this whole ship. Did they stop? They did stop. Okay, so I have good news and bad news. Five and ten. Okay, that's actually good.
Oh, this could be bad. This could be bad. Okay, we're good. Let's go straight to three. Fifteen's probably the best option there. I don't know if something might... Let's do that, actually. Whew. Not ideal situation. I'm pretty sure something spawned in R4. Uh, if that's the case, then that 20 that I got was very good. Oh, there is slime all in there. There's the fuel, there's a the terminal. How's time doing? Time is good. Thirteen and D five. I didn't see a vent in R four, but I didn't really look closely enough. Uh, but it also looks like it's been growing for a while. So that wasn't a two minute spawn. That wasn't a four minute spawn. That was probably a start. Also don't remember hearing swarm in R4, so I'm pretty confident on that result. And then from there, I know R10 is clear. Absolutely certain. There was slime in there. 
Well, it's dead now. Hello. Ooh, ooh, hello. Um, I don't need the sensor now. I don't even really need... that. I was not watching time. I have time. That could have gotten very bad, though. Okay, operation pick up everything else. There is a scrap in there, there's no way I'm gonna get that. There is a vent in there, so that verifies that theory. And then I'm going to have to vent out that room. That's fine. No, one has it. How close? Well, a few seconds close, plus a couple more for the radiation. Uh, I did get a fuel out of that, so that's good. I think despite its proximity to the uh, starting room, because it starts out with a threat, R4 probably is one room that a lot of people aren't going to be able to get to in time. That said, LB's just crazy. I, I I don't know. I can't keep up with them. I'm old. It's fine. Uh, no radiation on my screen, so I guess I was safe that time around. I believe there's a 10% chance, so if that is what it is. And the ship has been checked. Fully explored, thanks to the probe. I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, I am, because I put the, uh, the sensor on the damage drone. That's fine, it doesn't break or anything. Total of 705, only five scrap. I really thought that I picked up more and a lot of that was hidden. There was one more scrap that I could have gotten uh, but wasn't happening just because of the slime. And if it had happened, I believe that swarm spawned somewhere around the four minute mark. So that would have gone very badly as well. Wing jump fuel, starting score of 500. And one drone with two upgrades, and a probe is always a welcome, welcome pickup. Uh, I don't remember what the other one... Oh, it was another gather. And Dano managed to get the scrap, but took damage in the process. LB and I and Decavoid are all on the same level. ITJ, 695, uh, possibly taking one or possibly getting 20 slime damage. Uh, ending up in the same position as Dano. 
Possibly. And Longfellow, a 540, uh, doesn't look like he got to that back corner in time. And in fairness, with a ship like this, uh, it's compact but a little bit difficult. Sensor is not the what I've chosen for today. Uh, aside from stealth, I think lure would have been a very good option, especially with things being un uh, with things being unknown. And I'm not saying it would have been the best option, mind you, because things would have gone badly. But but I think if I had lure, I would have gone to check that corner room like I did already, found an empty room with a terminal, blown up some stuff, and then just been able to clean house with the rest of the ship extremely fast. If you haven't done your run yet, good luck. If you have, leave a comment with your own experiences and strategies for a ship like this. Like I said, overall, uh, that was an interesting little challenge today, but a little bit messy, especially with the swarm, especially with having a sensor and not being able to actively explore much of the ship because of swarms. But finding that defense and finding a couple of rooms that were clear did help things along. And then being able to just move things around from there wasn't too bad. If you'd like to check out other videos, you can see Marvin, Copper, Dano416, LB, Mustiga21, Dargar, Decavoid, Mercala, Corintoth, and Agenta1999, all listed in the video description. If you enjoyed, do please like, and have a good day.